Hello everyone, welcome back to this channel. Hope you are all doing good. So today's video is another DIY cartoon video, but this one is going to be really really easy. So let's get into it. For the pair of window curtains, I am taking 160 inches long fabric. So each one is going to be around 80 inches long. I prefer my window curtains little longer than my window size because it creates an illusion of a comparatively larger or bigger window. Okay, I bought this fabric from a local tailoring shop and it cost me 80 rupees per meter. Now that I have cut them according to the measurement, the next task is we have to make curtain holes. So I am keeping these 4 inches long, then I am folding it like this. And we have to just run a stitch along this fold. Coming to the lower portion, I'll give two folds of one and a half inch here. You can use your old sarees or dupattas to make these curtains and believe me they will look good. I know many of you don't have a sewing machine so you can hand sew the curtain and those who don't know how to sew they can get it done from a tailoring shop. Now I will run a stitch along the top hem of this curtain, it's optional though. Okay, the curtain base is totally ready. Now we will draw a design on them. But don't worry, I am not going to make it complicated. I will keep everything simple today. So I am thinking of doing block print and here is a potato and I will cut a triangle into it with this pencil knife. Now fill the shape with paint and paste it on the fabric. See, told you now, I'll keep it simple. So it's done but I'm finding it little empty at the sides uh, so I'm thinking of attaching lace over here and I bought this lace from a local shop at 5 rupees per 3 feet. Okay, while attaching the lace we'll keep this portion left and we'll hand sew it later on. Again this lace portion is totally optional, you can just keep it. But see, we find this type of block printed curtains everywhere online. So when you attach something extra like this lace or pom poms or tassels, it becomes extra special or distinct piece that only you would have but anyone else, isn't it? At least that's what my opinion is. Okay, let me answer some common questions that I get in such videos where I do the fabric paint. So the first one is, no, these paints don't wash away, it's as long lasting as your cloth or fabric. Second, you can hand wash or machine wash these painted cloths as many times as you wish. The third one is not actually answer to the questions, it's a tip. 
after 24 hours of painting add in the back side of the cloth i mean where you did the you know, fabric paint and all that the back side of it and it will be ready to use now if you wish to wash it you can do it after ironing otherwise you can use it as it is okay so our dry curtains are ready to hang Okay, as I said earlier, if you don't like sewing or don't want to bother with too much work, you can get it done by a tailor or even you can buy plain curtains from online and block print it according to your taste or preferences. So that's it for today's video. Hope you liked it. If so, give it a thumbs up and leave your feedback in the comment section. And don't forget to check out my other curtain videos that I already have in this channel. Also connect with me on Insta and Facebook. I am there also. I will give all the links in the video description below. So thank you so much again for your time. I will see you soon with a new video. Till then, take care. Bye.